Hi, my name is Frank. Welcome back to channel 33 RPM, your channel for vinyl gear and more. So I got this message from Christopher and he writes, at your convenience, can you answer a lingering question I've had for years? I see you and several folks in the YouTube vinyl community storing discs behind dust jackets and I just, and I just keep debating whether I feel good about it or not. Here are the responses I've generally gotten. I'll start with the one I don't care about to show off color variants. Number two, for convenience and quick access. Number three, to reduce the general wear and tear and friction on dust cover, vinyl, etc. So here is generally how I store my records. So here's the old traditional outer sleeve. I have the opening on top and I slide the record in on the back and along with the lyric sheet. And of course, there is the vinyl. I'm being clumsy here today and it's backwards, but the record generally goes in that way. And I started doing this about a decade ago and honestly, I started doing it purely out of convenience. I'll show you here how I used to sleeve records. I used to do it, I call it the traditional way. I don't know if it's actually the traditional way, but I would have the outer sleeve. So the opening of the outer sleeve match the opening of the record. That allows easy access to the record. Then I would slide it into my record shelf. But here is the issue I had. If you sleeve your records the traditional way and if you store your records like I do in these cubbies, when you go to slide your record into the shelves, the outer sleeve has a tendency to slide off. This is super annoying. It was driving me nuts. Like every single time, the outer sleeve was just sliding right off the jacket. So I said enough is enough and this is when I changed my record sleeving ways. So that's when I figured I would start doing it this way again with the old sleeve. And instead of having the sleeve match the opening, I put it on top and that would allow me to easily slide the record in. And when you do it, check this out. You put the record in the shelf, in your cubby or whatever you have. And when you pull it off, the outer sleeve does not slide off. So voila, easy, no nonsense, no hassle record storage. In addition, by sliding your actual record inside the outer sleeve, but outside of your jacket, you still have easy access to it, right? Like you don't have to take the outer sleeve off to, to get the record, it's right there. So not only is your sleeve not coming off, but you can at the same time continue continue to easily access your vinyl. So what else did Christopher write here? Yeah, the whole thing about showing off color variants. He says that's not really a big deal for him. It's not a big deal for me either. I've said this many times that like the whole color vinyl thing is cool, but I don't really go out of my way to seek out colored records. By colored, I mean non-black, right? Okay, black is still a color, but non-black vinyl. I mean, it's not a big deal for me. That's what I appreciate when a record is nicely pressed and the color of the record itself matches the overall packaging. There is something to be said for it, but it is not my my number one thing. But uh, there are some issues I most definitely have encountered with storing records this way. I mean, sometimes with the sleeve and if you have a couple of records, I mean, it can get pretty tight in there. And, and I always hate to kind of force a record in there or force a sleeve in there that always, I'm always wary or weary, wary of that. So I, I try to avoid that. So that can definitely um, be an issue. The other issue I've had is, so here's Kiss, Kiss Unplugged. And this record is a two LP set, but it's only a, a single pocket jacket, right? So um, as a result, the jacket's a little bit thicker to accommodate the two records. And the issue can be if you stuff too much in there and you stuff this on the record shelves, it can kind of squish the, the outer sleeve, right? Or the jacket, it can squish the jacket, which is uh, something none of us record collectors uh, are really too keen on to spend good money on records. You wanna preserve the whole package. So I did find that to be an issue as well, but, 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 I've uh, found some solutions to that. I'm using um, products from Vinyl Storage Solutions. Hold on, I just wanted to find a record 
record of the sleeve from Vinyl Storage Solutions so I could show this to you. And these are really cool if you haven't seen these before. So it's what they call a dual pocket sleeve, right? So there's two pockets, one in the front that is sealed where you can put your album jacket in there and another whole separate pocket at the back right where you can actually slide your record into the back so this way you're preserving the album jacket itself and you can still have easy access to the the vinyl record so that's one thing that i do in terms of oh, i'm looking away from the camera and i should never do that the other cool sleeve i found from vinyl storage solutions is this uh, special sleeve for gatefold albums right like it's one whole sleeve and um you can still see your gatefold using this and there's pockets to slide in records on both sides or one side it's got this sort of tuckable flap so I can still slide the record into the album jacket and it's still protected and the, the jacket itself is not getting squished, but I can still open it up and get easy access to it, right? And it has this little tuckable sleeve. So if you're worried about dust getting into your album jacket, you can just tuck that sleeve in and dust won't get there. So this for me is the ultimate solution. However, these outer sleeves are quite expensive. So it's not the solution for everything. So in general, I just use, here's another example. Here's the example. In general, I just use those vinyl storage solution uh, dual pocket sleeves and I can tuck the record into the back and I can keep doing it the way I've always Always been doing it and I'm protecting the album jacket so that is the way I generally sleeve my records there are always exceptions but as I said in general I found that this particular technique with sliding the record into the back has worked for me and as I said I started doing it purely out of convenience all right 33 there's a quick discussion on sleeving records let me know what you think in the comments below and let me know how you sleeve your records I hope you dug today's video if you did I would appreciate a quick thumbs up have a great rest of the week. Until next time, keep on spinning.